Well, here's something to warm you up on a very <laughs> chilly Thursday morning. It'd be great if we could just get into those warmer days. Wouldn't that be nice? Well, today's the 57th annual Atlanta Boat Show. It's at sale at the Georgia World Congress Center. Adam Harding has been out there all morning checking out all the great boats. You know what? No surprise that this is a big show, especially here in Georgia. I think we rank like in the top 15 or 20 uh, for boat registrations in the country, Adam. I can do you one even better. Top 10. Really? Even though we are not near really any oceans. Isn't that unbelievable? Wow. But look at this. We're in the Georgia World Congress Center. It's freezing outside. But this is a nice sight, right? You just imagine the beautiful blue skies and the sunny weather. Oh, it's right on the horizon. Here inside the Georgia World Congress Center, we're getting a sneak peek at the boat show before the doors open later on this afternoon for the first day of a weekend long event 57 years folks this event has been running and it only seems to get bigger every year in fact we're told from organizers this will be the biggest year yet right over my shoulder right here we're going to leave you on a little tease we're going to show you this boat coming up it has never been seen before and the price tag is over a million dollars but here's some cool things you can expect here at the georgia world congress and if you come down you can check out all the gizmos and gadgets that go inside of the engines here on all of these boats. We're talking about hundreds of boats that are stacked and lined up here in the Georgia World Congress Center. You can also, you know, find some accessories. We'll propel you into being big boat fans, huh? How about that? 6.45 in the morning, folks, and we're having a great time. We're joined this morning by Kevin Murphy. He is the show manager. Come on in here, Kevin. Tell us what we're doing in here. Tell us what fans can expect and why boats are always such a big deal here in Georgia. Boats are a big deal in Georgia. Number 10, and boat ownership in the state of Georgia. Uh, we have over 600 boats on the floor, personal watercraft, fishing boats, ski boats, a little bit of everything. Walk with me this way and show, show us what, what we can expect here at the Georgia World Congress Center because I think a lot of families who are watching maybe think to themselves, gee, it would be nice if, but not all these boats are all that expensive. They're not, we really have something for everybody. So if you're a family looking in to get into boating, we have pontoons, we do have personal watercraft, there are things for the kids to do. We have a fun zone for the kids. We have seminars if you want to learn better fishing techniques, sailing techniques, and things like that. And it's, it's for all ages, and the tickets are usually $15 when the doors open, but there is a 555 deal, $5 to come past five. You also get $5 beers. <laughs> And $5 valet. And, and that's a whole lot of fun for only that a is. couple of quick bucks. So doors open later on today. 11 o'clock. Tell me what's behind this curtain before we let things go, because this has been the tease all morning long. Top secret. Top secret. Brand new. Brand new. Cabo 41. Okay. We're going to unveil it 2 o'clock this afternoon. And the price tag is about? Just over a million dollars. Okay, well, that's not too shabby. Look at that. Gravier, Tracy, 2 o'clock today. Remember that we're going to be here. We're partnering up. We're going to be down here this weekend. I know Karen's going to be here. Rodney's going to be here. Vince. I don't know how Vince even has time with the Super Bowl a couple of weeks away, but we're going to be partnering up. We're going to be reading to folks here at the Georgia World Congress Center. Remember, the doors open today and at 2 o'clock today. Maybe, just maybe, maybe. I'm going to put my name in the running for this. Uh, <laughs> Why not, dollar. right? Uh, it's, it's always good to have a friend with a boat. Oh, by the way, I should tell right? you, I talked in the last hour about getting into a bathing suit ready because we're talking uh -huh, about right? boats and beach weather. Right after the live shot, I went and ate chocolate. So, um, <laughs> you know, failure on my part, I suppose. Well, you do uh -huh. look a little tan, Adam, so that's, that's at least a start. And as far as Vince that's goes. That's makeup. Come on, that's makeup. <laughs> Vince is flying around on private jets and stuff for the Super Bowl, and he's probably going to be on that yacht. All right. Thank you, Adam.